So walking around the cemetery, there's a bunch of old abandoned military buildings. Like that one, it says A276. And at one point, it looks like it had someone that would climb up there. It almost looks like some kind of jail or something. And they have a siren. I don't know. A lookout tower. They don't want you going in there. Caution, U.S. Navy property. Munitions. Response area. No entry without escort. So they got some live ammunition back there somewhere. More abandoned buildings. Don't know what the significance of this is. But it's probably munition storage. Another building here. A54. This is interesting. So this has got railroad tracks here that would have went right where these trees are. And they have a fire hydrant on that side of the fence. There's actually fire hydrants everywhere. So I think this is a definitely munitions. But the train tracks are a mystery to me. Look at those big turbine motors. Don't know what those did. Anybody know what those did? This one's A75 or 78. There's like a loading dock here. And here's another abandoned building. And this one also had railroad tracks coming up to it. So this whole facility had railroad tracks at one time. That's interesting. What is this? Forget me not. Maryland rocks keep something. It's like a jar full of uh, goodies that someone left. Interesting. They don't seem to want anybody checking all these places out, that's for sure. They got an old baby stroller back here that's locked. Okay, that's extremely strange. It's like an old baby stroller that's got a lock on it. And it looks like it's been here for a while. Gonna walk carefully through here because, like I said, rattlesnake country. See if there's anything else on the other side to look at. Nope. It's another end of a concrete building.
Here's the front side of it. This one doesn't have a number, does it? A167. Huh, you know what I just noticed? Do you notice it? The birdhouse is up there. That's pretty cool, actually. They're like modern birdhouses. There's two of them. So someone is trying to keep a bird that nests here around, I guess. more abandoned buildings that are protected by barbed wire. Big huge power generator there of some kind. High voltage. A142. And these, they look like they go underground down below. You know, a lot of these um, places when they're constructed have um, underground tunnels in case there is an air raid coming in. Here's an interesting view down the corridor there. You have to imagine this is all um, back in 1940s, 30s, 40s, 20s, all that. That's how bustling this would be. And the average person like me couldn't be standing here, that's for sure. This is highly restricted military base. As you can see by the sign. I'm just walk a little farther, see if there's anything else that's interesting. You see those lights? So they did some here at night too. Well you can see all the abandoned buildings there, the towers. And I think this is an old emissions, like I said before. I think eventually all this is going to turn into housing and business. It's 2021 now, I bet in 10 years this is all going to be torn down. I know there's an issue with the soil here. That they got to get rid of. The soil's got some toxins in it from all the years of military use. And that's very expensive to get out. A lot of abandoned stuff here. There's lots of bob wire. Show you all these military vehicles here. They still got military vehicles there. Military jeeps, transport. So there's still some activity going on in this place. As you can see, lots of military jeeps and vehicles there. A lot of storage of them. As for the day, the earth stands still. <laughs> U.S. Army Reserve, so this is an active building here. See all the uh, cranes and dry docks. There's 
definitely an interesting place. And it's kind of creepy all at the same time. Look at all that. All those barracks and stuff, totally abandoned. You got all these cranes and steel. There must be a building something out here. Big project here going on. You see that giant crane in the middle? That thing's on rollers. Look at that crane. That thing's impressive, huh? Right by the big no trespassing sign. That's a big crane. And they got this uh, scaffolding here. If anybody knows what they're making there, is that related to a ship? Like a, looks like a giant sail or something. Pretty interesting. All this military housing and danger keep out. And Definitely don't want you snooping around here. It's all boarded up, all the windows. But there are places that are open, like what I'm driving on this road. And you can't drive in there anymore. Look at that, all weathered and it says under construction. Danger. Doesn't look like it's under construction to me. Not sure what those big cement blocks are for. 